Well even though it wasn't anywhere close to what happened at Coldstone Creamery, I can still call this job a bad one. I even ran into someone from my job as a firefighter. That guy who appeared to be a boxer wanted something involving steak. I mean, if he wants to keep his build the way it is, he needs to cut down on the meaty products. I happened to meet another person in a thief attire, which was some woman who I assumed was a guy at first. The part where this kid in blonde hair wanted chili deluxe was there too. That's basically everything. So, this is the 91st time I've been fired. Where should I work next? I know. I'll get a job at Sonic Drive-In. Welcome to Sonic Drive-In. How may I help you? I would like to order two Super Sonic Devil Cheeseburger meals with a side of fries and water please. Okay, but why two though? I don't see anyone else with you. Are you picking these up for a friend or something? Actually, this is all for me. I love cheeseburgers and fries so much. They're my favorite foods of all time. What? No. Now I'm seriously not going to give you anything after what I've heard. Have you ever heard of people who threw up overeating so much food? Yes, I know that, but that would rarely ever happen. I've been here a few times, so they foods aren't stuffy as you think. They are stuffy. I'm making sure to let let you order so much food and make yourself sick to the point you get indigestion. Dude, I'm a teenager. I know about my health and how too much food is bad. I do appreciate you being concerned though. Oh really? If you're a teenager, then how about? Oh, I see a cheeseburger behind you. What? Where? Dude, what was that for? That's a good example of why eating so much is a bad idea. Like how I said to a certain white chinchilla. Hurts doesn't it? You're crazy. If this is how you're going to treat me, I'm out of here. Wow. What a pussy. Welcome to Sonic Drive-In. How may I help you? I would like to order some coke please. What? Are you telling me you came to this place, just to buy coke? Actually, that's not it. I would also like to order corn dog. Still, I think you can get more good stuff than that dude. Oh, I know. But one question, can you guess my name? Well, I can't get a single clue. Do you mind giving me a hint? Vrahin, it's a chemical element. Like nickel, it's found in the Earth's crust only in chemically combined form, save the small deposits found in alloys of natural meteorogyne. Don't tell me. Your name is? You. My name is Cobalt. Hey, you want to know what I think of your name? Alright, shoot. Get out. Your name is bad. Like seriously, your name is based entirely off a chemical element. And also, who would name their child Cobalt anyway? Oh, come on. You're not amused even by one bit. Don't you have a sense of humor? I do have a sense of humor. I still think Cobalt is a terrible name. That's why I wasn't amused. Ha 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 ha. Why did I tell the rest of my brothers this? Whatever. It's not like they're gonna care. Welcome to Sonic Drive-In. How may I help you? I would like to get a Sonic Bacon Cheeseburger please. Sure. But why the burger alone? I think it would be good for a meal. I know. It's just I don't have enough money for that. That's why I'm getting only the burger. Okay. But that will be $500. Wait a second $500? I'm seeing the price right now, and it looks to be just $3.29, which I have. I'm currently with $5 in my pocket right now. Well, sucks to be you, because then I can't give you your burger. Okay, listen here. Just because you need money doesn't mean you can get it that way. I am not paying $500 and that is final. If you're trying to cheat for money I'm leaving. Fine. Then get out and never return. 
I could stab you with my sword if I wanted to. I'm not scared even after you said that. Okay okay. A little too far. Welcome to Sonic Drive-In. How may I help you Vampire Slayer? I would like to order a hickory cheeseburger meal with a chicken strip dinner. Wait, did you just call me Vampire Slayer? Yes I did Vampire Slayer. I feel like calling you that since you have the looks of one. I see you carrying a stake and cross. I appreciate it, but really, you don't have to call me that. Not here at least. Come on Vampire Slayer. We're in a place where vampires can't get us. Besides, I met a few gothic people in previous jobs I got, including a vampire bat. Are you talking about Count Dracula? No. What do you mean Vampire Slayer? Never mind. And again, you don't have to call me Vampire Slayer. What? Come on Vampire Slayer, you can tell me anything. Just move on. I don't want to talk about it right now. What, are you afraid a vampire bat will come out of nowhere and suck all your blood while you're sleeping? Although I saw one before, it wouldn't be even close ha 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 ha. What the hell? So you think vampires killing people is funny? You're so evil and heartless. I'm out of here. Wait vampire slayer. I'll make it up to you by giving some garlic. Come back. Do me a favor and stop calling me Vampire Slayer, gosh. I'll literally stake your heart if you don't leave me alone. I was just asking. I didn't mean it that way. Welcome to. Hold on. Aren't you that same jerk who worked the 7-Eleven? No. That was a different person. You're not lying to me, eh? Things are very suspicious. I'm not. Are you positively sure you're not lying? I freaking said I'm not freaking lying. I knew it. You're the same guy after all. Because back when you refused to give me my bag of spicy sweet chili Doritos, you got impatient with me, and now you're doing it again. Fine. You got me. Care to explain why you're working at Sonic Drive-In and not 7-Eleven? Nope. Why? Are you scared to admit something? I already told you, no. Then answer this question. Why are you here and not at 7-Eleven? Okay. You got me again. I got fired. That's how I ended up here. If I didn't get fired, I wouldn't be here right now. Ah. You got fired. Serves you right for being a jerk to everybody. That gives more reason into proving you're the same guy. I feel like starting a mental breakdown if you don't get out of this place right now. Whatever. I was about to leave anyway. I hope this will be the last time I'll ever see you again. Levi Ackerman. How dare you be rude to the customers. Most especially my partner and best friend, Simon. That's it. You're fired. Get out of here now.